Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to create this type of Christmas ornament lights. So let's get started. First create a new artboard. 1920 by 1080. Now we need to select the ellipse tool and uh, make the foreground color dark. That's about it and make an ellipse like an egg shape now select the direct selection tool move the top anchor point a little bit up holding the shift key and the middle anchor point a little bit bottom so it will make a kind of a light shape that's about it it looks good for me now we need to use a gradient so we'll go to the gradient tool and fill up with the gradient we need to change the gradient color so select a color from the swatches and drag it on the gradient color same for the second color kind of uh, this color let's try yeah this looks good for me and now change the uh, gradient type to radial gradient now we need to adjust the gradient a bit so click on G or select the gradient tool from here and also change the gradient color shape to a kind of an egg shape so it matches our design that's about it looks good for me now we need to duplicate the layer press ctrl c and ctrl f as you can see now we have two different layers we will change the gradient to something else a black and white gradient so you can select the black and white gradient over here same uh, also the radial gradient now we need to change the blending mode for this gradient so go to transparency and change the blending mode to screen as you can see it's giving us a kind of a glow so again go to the gradient tool and adjust the gradient it's totally up to you how you want the gradient to the light to look this looks good for me that's about it so group the both of the layers now we need to make the bottom part for the light create a rectangle with a dark color make all the corner curves that's about it we can make it a little bit more rounded and make these two corners flat that's about it get another uh, rectangle on top of this kind of a, this type of shape and align both of them now also may, uh, adjust the corners now select the pen tool and Hold the Alt key and click and drag the selection. That's about it. Okay. Now we need to give a little kind of a texture on top of this. So select the rectangle tool and create this type of shape. Fill up with white color. Uh, we need to put it on top of this. Okay. Now we need to bring down the opacity to 25. then go to the transform tool while transform tool there it is and now you can move the one corner to top that's about it like the move tool again zoom it a bit then over holding down the alt key and drag it it will duplicate the layer that's about it and then press ctrl d to duplicate it multiple times that's about it 
so we want this to go to the top select and bring it on the top select all the layers bottom layers and with the shape builder tool we will remove the extra areas just hold the alt key and remove the extra areas that's about it this looks good for me also with this uh, part uh, we need to do one more thing select the pen tool and also bring it uh, a little bit top a little bit down looks better yeah this kind of looks better for me so also uh, now we need to put something else on the bottom <laughs> same corner with the same color little bit up adjust the corners that's about it zoom it a bit then bring it um, back you can right click and arrange bring it back you can do that or you can use the keyboard shortcut that's about it make it a little bit larger looks good for me now group all of them and move it to the bottom and you can adjust the size according to your requirement our first light has been created so select all of them and group them so in order to change the color of the light we need to just duplicate it just hold down the alt key and drag it it will duplicate it automatically with the active light selected just click on the recolor artwork and move it on the right so you can see the active light and you can just change the color from over here whatever you like or you can manually change the color from gradient I'll show you that also that's about it this is one way to do it and then I'll duplicate the first one again move it over here go to layer section uh, sorry this layer this is the active layer inside group we have the light this is the light part we need to select the last uh, layer which is the main gradient for the light select that and click on the gradient tool now you can choose other colors for the light and choose the kind of green color for now so it will be kind of a light green this should be the outer color dark green that's about it this is how you can change all the light colors if you do it manually the color changing it will be much better color so let's move them uh, on the side and make it a little bit smaller okay that's about it now with the pen tool make kind of wire shape Now we can put our lights uh, on top of this just move it those over here shrink them down make this a little bit smaller and now we can put the lights over here you can change the light colors and duplicate those and that's about it I am just showing you with three lights you can make as many lights with those as you want That's how you make Christmas lights with Illustrator.